being homeless um, was a big, big um, part of my life that I didn't like. I love the shelter. This is this, this, they provided for me. They provided for me here at this place. Um, the area is very nice. You know, I like um, getting out, walking, and um, and coming back to my house with keys and stuff, and getting in. To compare to the streets where you just everything's just open, you have nothing, and everything's everything's open but locked. You know what I mean? Uh, the theory behind housing first is that uh, is that the just the instability of not knowing where you're going to sleep on any given night, um, not knowing if you're going to be safe, if you're going to be warm, that that is going to like exacerbate perhaps existing mental health issues or existing substance use issues. So it's going to drive you to want to use more. So if you think about that for someone experiencing homelessness, um, where you've got like lots of dangers, lots of variables going on, it, it's reasonable that someone would want to, you know, would want to try to medicate that um, because of the fears, the dangers, the depression, the anxiety. So Housing First says, get someone into housing first, the very beginning, and then start addressing those other issues and see exactly how much they're they're really uh, an ongoing. Um, piece of that uh, that individual's story and how much of it is actually connected to the instability and the lack of safety that they have in their everyday life. The, the, the main thing of being here and being from the streets is that you have no no um, facilities to even really like take showers, um, wash your clothes, you know, and really just go out there to like really cook your food. You know what I'm saying? It's, just, it's, very, it's very difficult on that part, waking up every morning to uh, wasn't well, use a bathroom, shower or bathe or uh, bird bath. You know, all those is just very was very 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 difficult. It was just stressful to me that part of my life. They open up more when they know, like like Otis, for example, like his situation. Talking to the neighbor, like they became really close. Our neighbors across the street are really close with Otis because he's not just. A homeless man. He's a person who had barriers and issues that caused him to be in his situation and he is working so hard to like overcome everything in life and do better yeah. and it's a beautiful thing yeah. and it's beautiful when people like just open their eyes to that. Uh, my experience here is um, is very special you know because this this where I'm at right now I'm in a good position with the housing and uh, my situation of, of coming out of a homeless situation, this is awesome for me. This is very awesome, you know. Um, the people I get along here is very respectable. I get along with everybody. Um, and the only thing, we keep the chores up, you know. And, um, and I like all the, the monitors and all the um, caseworkers and everybody who comes here and helps us, you know. Uh, I appreciate all that.